Hello Capricorn, welcome to my channel, welcome to this coming week's reading. For this week I am reading from the coffee cup and then I'll be drawing out cards from the Modern Way Tarot deck here. Also please do like, share and subscribe if you haven't done so already. Do hit that notification bell also, it truly would help. Okay Capricorns, let's see what we have for you. Capricorn, Capricorn, Capricorn. Hmm... There's something here showing that you're like picked out like a like a fish out of a pond here. You're like not the pond, the sea. You you like out of this big, you know, you're like you have the sea or the ocean and there's so you know like random choices or, or anybody can like pick that fish i'm not calling you a fish it's just like a little metaphor kind of and um and <laughs> and you happen to get picked and you're you're like whoo out of like all these thousands of other fish and you're the one that gets picked um to not to be eaten or anything just to to like um it's like there's there's a there's a chosen energy here i know it started off really weirdly and sorry my metaphors can be so weird sometimes la, 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 la. anyway you you get like um it's and it feels random to you it feels very very random <laughs> you know it's but you can do it it's like oh am i ready for this like you're asking yourself you know but you're excited at the same time don't doubt yourself I do feel like you'll clear out your doubt very quickly and you're very good at that. It's like, oh, can I do this? Yes, I can. Even if you have no experience in it, you know, you could be like, maybe you applied for a job and you didn't actually feel perhaps you were the, the best qualified candidate for it, but somehow you get picked. You get the job over someone that had way more experience. Um, but there's very good reasons for that. You know, and it could be your confidence. It could be your more willingness to learn and your eagerness and knowing that you, 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 you can do it. You have that sense of responsibility. Perhaps the person that had more experience didn't really show that, that kind of enthusiasm. You know, um, again, just an example. But something's going to be very, very clear to you, you know. And I do see here, Capricorn, you're going to feel very special. And you should. You absolutely should. You know, it's like it, you're very, very radiant, very radiant. And it's like, oh, I wasn't quite expecting this. And sometimes the best things come when it's unexpected. So it's like some, you know, surprises here and there. I do see you wanting to do some digging around, something that makes you feel kind of suspicious. You're wanting to dig for some further detail news of something. Um, something feels like not quite right with some sort of situation. It could involve what I do get, something very specific now of a message, something to do with a sister, something that's related to a sister. You're wanting to, you know, kind of watch her back, look out for her. It doesn't have to be a sister. It could be any kind of figure that you're close to. It's like you're you're becoming um, like the, the mama bear here, just wanting to make sure all is okay. And I do see... Again, for some of you, maybe you're trying to collect evidence. You're just trying to make sure that everything is in good working order and no surprises in a bad way. You are getting surprises, but in a good way. But in the bad way, you're trying to make sure that, you know, you have the brakes on that. For some of you, you could be relocating. There's a new house or some sort of opportunity relocating or perhaps just traveling. You're needing, I, I do see a destination. You're going off to a different destination, something that feels, so possibly a temperature that's a little bit cooler than where you are currently. Of course, that could be just for the few. Um, there is something that is starting to be in the process and progress that you'll be hearing news about shortly. Something that's kind of taken its time and you've had to be patient about also. I do see for some of you, you could be wearing, again, very specific and random message here, could be wearing your hair very differently. You're being looked at differently in a good way. Like just gaining more attraction and more attention here. 
Hmm. Something is going to start to be, res uh, there's a resume, you're going to resume something that was uh, placed on hold. Uh, getting back into action here, Again, getting back into action, you're feeling more lively and stronger than ever. And like your eating habits as well, I do see changing a little bit. There's some um, nostalgia coming in. You know, there's like deep feelings and emotions coming through when you're thinking of this, when you're in this nostalgic period here. I do see for some of you, it could be um, working through things with your partner because you both want to be in a better place. But you'll see they may make more of an effort these days as well. Okay, oops. Let's see what the cards have for you. Woo! Sorry, one second. Fell on the ground. Okay, two of pentacles. Two of pentacles. Sorry. Ah, six of swords. <laughs> and the knight of pentacles. Yep. Definitely making a move, a change. You know, it's talking about a relocation, or there's something here that is starting to progress to happen. Um, taking charge here from the Two of Pentacles. I see you taking charge, and there's something that, again, you will feel like it's your responsibility. Or like you're the best person to do it, you know, no longer kind of wanting to juggle on multiple things at the same time and just leaving something behind. You're no longer wanting to live in chaos. And well, I do again see there's something that has been in your plans that you are resuming that you're it's and it feels good. You know, it feels like it's the next logical step for you. There's like an opening here where you, you're definitely kind of going on board and walking um, onto something a lot smoother and something that's long term, something that's a lot more um, trustworthy as well. You can rely on the situation or on this person, whereas before it felt like a little bit, oh, up, down, here and everywhere. But you're moving on to something that is definitely a lot more secure and stable. You're working for the long term here. The death card. Okay. Oh, and the will. Okay. The death card and the will of fortune. Mm. Definitely something that feels, okay, awakened. Like, yes, this is, this is the start here. There's something, you know, a transformation has been happening behind the scenes that you're starting to see in front of you on the physical plane here. And we're talking about some kind of something that's unexpected, you know, unexpected um, surprises here, but in the good sense, something that is turning around, something that is very, very fitting to your life, to to where you are, where you're going to be. And I do see something that it is something that you have spoken about, and sometimes things that you speak about is manifesting without you even realizing. But there's definitely a very deep personal transformation happening as well that's really kind of turning around. You're turning over a new leaf, a very big new leaf here. You're stepping out of your comfort zone for some of you as well. And I do see you establishing some grounds here. You're very, very kind of, uh, you know, once you establish certain boundaries or something, that's it. And others will kind of uh, listen, follow along. And I do see there's something about transparency. I don't know if I mentioned transparency in your last reading. Hmm. But I, it's coming through again. Things are going to be very transparent. Nothing is going to be like hidden from you. Oh. Oh. Wow. I said nothing's going to be hidden from you. And then the moon card comes out. That is crazy. The moon card is basically something that's going to come through. Something that has been hidden that's going to come through. How crazy is that? Mm. 
Wow. You're definitely being guided. Could be, you know, by a higher source, listening to your intuition here. And learning to act upon that as well. The moon is very significant here for you. And it allows you also to, to bring up things that are important. And, and it's like not wanting to drag anything that was not good from the past into the future. So everything is going to come up, you know, that... I do see it, it's time. And we're talking about transparency. That is so crazy. That needs to be talked about so you know where you and everybody else stands also. But you're definitely being highly guided here. What was unknown will be known. You know, and again, listen to your intuition. There's something that is coming through. Definitely things that are being... Oh, so I just felt like pulling out another card. Okay, and here the four of ones. Um, something definitely that's going to come through that works out really well. Works out in your favor here with the four of ones. There is, we're talking about that stability here and that's what's coming through. And I do see you're going to find common ground with someone as things do reveal itself, as things do turn around and things definitely become transparent then there is happier times. There is this connection happening, a strong connection. You know, something that's going to last a lot. And I do see you've gone through these challenges if it's with a partner or some sort of partnership. And I was talking about working through things. There you go. How things really do come. And this could happen what may feel like suddenly, but... Every step that you've taken, if you've just, you know, um, been in tune with yourself and take those steps that you know is necessary, it starts to, like, come through very, very strongly. There's something here of a renewal that is happening. We have the sun here and the death card or the flag, and here is the moon. Everything's starting to really balance out. It's being seen. And that progress is, is it really, really matters where you're headed to here as well. Like definitely a very deep, strong connection, something that feels renewed and powerful for you. Love it. Oh, Capricorn, thank you so very much for being here. I truly, truly hope that this was helpful. Please do let me know. I appreciate all of you so very much. Do take care and until next time.